Hello and welcome to a new tutorial. This is Daisy. Today I'm going to show you when and how to refill your sublimation printer tanks. Epson recommends refilling the tanks when the ink reaches the first line from below. But personally, I recommend filling them when they get below the second line. I like to use Hippo sublimation ink. These bottles are the easy fill. They make the filling process very easy and clean. Now, if you wish to start using another sublimation ink brand, not a problem. You may refill the tanks using the new ink of your choice. I will link the Hippo sublimation ink in the description below. They also have very good quality sublimation paper. I'm going to link both in the description below. I'm going to start refilling the tanks with the sublimation ink. When you open the lid, you will get this message on the printer screen. Press proceed, then it will indicate us to refill the tanks. Leave it like that and let's go fill the tanks. It is very important to follow the order of the colors. On my printer, the first one is for the black ink, the second one for the cyan, the third for the magenta, and the last one for the yellow. So I don't get confused, I prefer to just uncover the tank I'm going to be filling. I'm going to start with the black one. As I mentioned before, I'm going to be using Hippo Sublimation Ink. I love this easy to fill bottles as they do the filling super easy and fast. And above all, without ink spillage. It's already full. Save the leftovers for next time. Let's do the same process for the next colors. I will store the leftovers in the same box. Go back to the screen, click on next, and here you're going to select the colors you already refilled. Then click proceed, and yes, and okay. As you can see, the process is super easy. Now I'm going to make a print so you can see how it comes out. I am using Hippo Sublimation Paper. And here is the printing. I'm going to use this printing to sublimate a tumbler. Stay tuned because this one is going to be my next tutorial. Also, I'm going to be posting this template for free download on my blog. I hope you enjoyed this small tutorial and please don't forget to support my channel by subscribing, liking, commenting, sharing and by pressing the notification bell. Thank you for your visit and I'll see you in my next tutorial.